tonight. It's RuPaul's Drag Race Season 15. It's the highly anticipated reunion episode. Kevin Bacon makes a guest appearance. Gaga Chandra. And we finally get the bonus footage of the reading challenge. This is Reality Reflex. Before we begin, make sure that you like and subscribe so you can get all of the Drag Race and Reality TV content. Hey everyone, it's Tedley here, and going into tonight, fans were obsessing over the fact that Princess Poppy showed up looking just like Rebecca Glasscock from Season 1, Episode 1. I'm quoting drag. You're welcome. Actually living for Princess Poppy referencing Drag Race history. Princess Poppy as Rebecca Glasscock at the Drag Race reunion is one of the funniest moments in TV history. I'm sorry, but I'm literally such a Princess Poppy stan, like she is so iconic. Absolutely. Of course, one of the first recaps of the night was of the twins, and fans had lots to say about this one. Sugar and Spice still talk so much, but they're so funny. Definitely don't miss seeing the twins every week. Sugar and Spice are iconic and I love them. I don't care. We love a star-studded moment and this reunion did not disappoint because this time around, we got Kevin Bacon. Kevin Bacon? Lucy getting a tweet and personal video from Kevin Bacon is insane. Who is Kevin Bacon? Is this bitch for real? This reunion seems to be all about Mistress Isabel Brooks. She is motherfucking running the show. The way Mistress is the main character of this reunion, you'd think she already won. So far, Mistress has been 99% of the reunion and I'm not mad. This is the Mistress show. This is your moment! Have it! The spiciest moment of the whole episode was when the mothers of some of these drag queens showed up to call out other bitches on the show. Not this. Why is the most drama we're getting tonight from their parents? I'm dying. Oh, the moms want the smoke for real. Now why are moms involved? What the fuck is going on in here on this day? And of course, another standout moment from this reunion was when we finally got the bonus content from the reading challenge. I knew we had more footage. They let us have it. They should have left these in. Oh, they really fucked up with the time cut. These reads are everything. Damn you, WeHo. This season, like no other, has attracted a lot of hatred from online fans, and Mistress Isabel Brooks took a moment out in this reunion to call out the racism in the fan base. Mistress Isabel Brooks just spilled the tea. People are racist and fatphobic, and it shows. On a serious note, the racist-ass white gays have been insufferable this season, and I need y'all to shut the fuck up. You're ruining the show for everyone else. I'm glad Mistress said what needed to be said. This reunion in these two hours definitely had its ups and downs, but all in all, the fans thought this one was a little bit on the boring side. This reunion is longer than the first 10 episodes. This was the most boring and repetitive reunion ever. Definitely should have been only an hour. We will never get another reunion as iconic as season nine. All right, everyone. So that is my official review of RuPaul's Drag Race season 15, the reunion episode. Stay tuned and come back next week for the finale episode of RuPaul's Drag Race season 15. This is Reality Reflex.